please describe for this committee the actions you took during your time in Vietnam. I spent a couple months in Saigon. Then I was transferred to a base in Laos that was operated by the Special Activities Division. We trained and equipped the Hmong and then turned them loose on the NVA. We're running arms and supplies via the Ho Chi Minh Trail. And you worked with Lincoln Clay in what eventually became the Phoenix Program. Within a year or so, Lincoln was heading up his own PRU. We'd cross over into Vietnam and locate enemy targets and either kill them or bring them back for interrogation. <laughs> Just thinking about it? Jesus Christ. You wouldn't believe the shit we did to those cocksuckers. Hey guys, welcome back to Mafia 3. Okay, we are still here in Cassandra's place in the garage. Let's go ahead and change to our next outfit, which is going to be still a, an action outfit. And it's going to be, we did Full Metal Jacket 2, we're going to go do it on leave. Which is kind of like his default outfit, it kind of seems like. I don't know if that's the default one or it's, if not, it's pretty close. Um, so, yeah. All right, guys, uh, I'm never going to get used to that button. Okay. There's only two more places in Delray Hollow that we don't have completely bugged, and that's this place and this place. So what I'm going to do in this put this section, we got the two guys we got to take down: Doug Hatchet Mar Marchetti, and then this guy Deacon Caruso. Um, so I think what I want to do, and this is where the nightclub is. Um, I think I want to go hit this junction box first, and uh, we shall go bug it so that we can see what we're see all the people that were, you know, uh, were attacking through the walls and whatnot. I believe that's the, that's what happens with the junction box, I think, right? I don't, I want to say that's right. That's what they said, isn't it? So let's go do that first. Be careful. I will be careful, my friend, I will be. So we're gonna go back in. I guess it's. Oh. Mm. Mm. Not really. What? That's not really ideal. I don't want to get into it with them. Uh, before I do this, this might work. Yeah, there we go. I think that's gonna work. Let's go around the other side. <laughs> Ding. Stick some thingies in here. Stop moving around. Yeah, that cost me three. And I ain't exactly religious, but having the whole city supplies sitting around here with the Jesus staring at us does make me a mad nervous. Hmm. Okay, let's see what we got. Goodies in this 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 section. You got a bar, you got some sort of eatery. Here you got an album cover. There's a fuse. Another fuse, I take it the green ones are fuses. Uh there's communist propaganda. There is an album cover here. No playboys. Okay, that's that's fine. All right. Looks like we're going after this guy. Let's see, which button is it? Now, how much ammo do I have? Could be better. Stop moving around. Time to take out the trash. I found him. Come on. He's over here. He's tearing us a new one. I'm tearing you a new one.
Somebody sniping at me. Bye-bye. Stand up. Thanks for knocking that fence down for me. Reinforcement. Is you the reinforcement? <laughs> I'm gonna bust this up just because I can. All right, let's go get some money. Thanks, boys. There's a couple of hundred and fifty dollars. Got anything else I can steal? No? Everybody good? I'm gonna go get this fuse while I'm here. Thank you, boys. I'll be having that. Thank you so much. All right, now we got to go talk to Donovan, yes, but first, Deacon Caruso, you're up, my friend, you're up. Let's see, where'd I park my car? I think I parked out here. Gentlemen, Mr. Deacon Caruso, just wait right there, I'm coming, don't you worry. Problem with this gun. I don't get ammo for it. Hey, there's none of that. Need a second to reload. Got everybody? Thanks for the $250. I know you are nervous, but when Georgie shows up, just take a breath and stay cool. And don't ask questions. Charlie's a good man, but if you start prattling on and make him look bad in front of Georgie, he'll end up you for sure. 
Alright. Album cover. Alright, album cover. Let's check it out. This button. Alright guys, we got ourselves an album cover, uh, which is here. Eddie Floyd. Knock on wood. Nice. Very, very cool. There's more money over here. They're 250 bucks. Sweet. So I guess we're done, huh? We don't need to bring that out. Yeah, that's the only bad thing about this pistol. Is I don't get ammo for it, really. Anything interesting about? Cops in there. Trespassing. Who's trespassing? I'm gonna go ahead and break into here. Hope you don't mind. I need to grab a hold of um, your supplies. Where the hell are they? <laughs> they say they're here. Oh, I guess we got to use. Heal is up. Yeah, there we go. All right. Restock. Cool. Cool. I think we're good. I think we are good. All right. That's all done. Now. How do I get out of here? This place is overly dark. Okay, now that we've done that. Yeah, trespass here, fool. Um, I guess we just gotta go take out, we gotta go talk to Donovan. And then we're gonna go take out this guy. Both enforcers have been killed. Um, before we do that though, let's go grab these last Three items, so we're gonna go back to our car, which is just up this way. And then we'll go talk to Donovan. Let's see. How did I, how did I get in here? I, think I came through this way, right? Hey my bud, you got some money? Uh along the way, I think what we'll do is we'll we'll call the um the guy. This guy. I'm running low. Can you send supplies to Delray Hollow? Going at you. Hang tight. We got to get restock on our ammo since I used it up. You spot anything you can use? Let me see what you got. Use it. Refill ammo, 240 bucks. Done. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and see what we got in here. Um, let's talk about automatic weapons. We own that. Actually, let's talk about handguns. Why does that have an exclamation point? Um, low damage. We have the Silentium, but I, I'm not using it. I'm not really sure. I understand that. So I own all this. All right, semi-automatic. All right, cool. All right. Uh, what else we got? Supplies, upgrades. Adrenaline storage, 100 grand. Yeah, 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 I don't have 100 grand. I have 10 grand. I have, no, sorry, I have a thousand dollars. You gotta be joking. Um, hmm. None of this can I get? Flies. No. Uh, vehicle mods. Suspension upgrades. No. Uh, equipment. In good I'm getting out. So, let me just see if I understand this right. How do I set something up in here? That's not my weapon. I really want. Guess you just equip the one that you want from the tr from the van. It's 
seems weird, but sure. Okay, uh, we are heading for Donovan. Oh, no, sorry. No, we are not. I, I take that back. That is that is a lie. We are heading for this view. Yeah, let's go clear this place out. That sounds like a really good idea. And then we'll go talk to Donovan. Who's trans trespassing? We're talking about enemy turf. <laughs> that was smooth. Okay, now we got to get back in, back in, or back into this area somehow. There we go. Thank you. My ooh, there's a tack vest over here. I want it? Where's my tack vest? In this truck? Is it... Where the hell is it? In this house? I'm very confused. Where's the tack vest? I was told there was a tack vest here. Is this the strip club? That's a weird texture. This is the strip club. Okay, is it upstairs? Ah, oh, for God's sakes. Y'all are being a pain in my ass. Excuse me, boys. How you doing? No, it's downstairs. See how it's downstairs now? Eyes. Okay, here it is over here. Thank you. Primony. Like pulling teeth. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's see where we're going. We'll zip down here and grab this communist pop propaganda. by a, a deal. We'll get the deal as long as we're here. Oh, hell. Excuse me while I mess this up. I'm just going to pop in here real quick. And grab this thing. Thank you very much. Alrighty, we got that. And one last one. I guess it's just over here, huh? Over at the whatever this is. Go ahead and check that out. Propaganda. Uh, equality. Forward for all. Nice. There you go. There's that. And that's that district taken care of. Now let's go talk to Donovan. Coming through. Yeah, coming through. 
Okay, we're heading over here. I don't know why we have to go talk to Donovan. I know where he is. This way. Y'all need to get out of the middle of the road, please. You are in my way. All right. Donovan, here we come. I don't see him. He's supposed to be here. Buddy. Yep, let's do it. I've been listening in on old Charlie. And he isn't such a bad fellow. He's more of a kinder, gentler redneck. And as luck would have it, his wife is expecting. Man in that situation usually doesn't care who he works for, as long as he's still above ground. <laughs> Poor sap starts blubbering when the two of them talk about names. Right now, it's between Bocephus and Thomas Lee. Anyway, his guys have the church locked down. And all of them are more of the shoot first, let God sort them out variety of redneck. You get your hands on Charlie, though. He'll do what he's told without putting up much of a fuss. All your intel's been updated. You going back to the motel? After I get something to eat, I'll see you when you're done dealing with these inbred assholes. Cool. Okay, we're taking on the church. Oh, there's a whole bunch of them. Cars full. Four finger Charlie Kincaid. Oh, I guess we're here. Sort of. All right. All right. Recruiting bosses. Remember that when that you've previously wiretapped the church and it's smack racket. Because you've done this, you now have the option to kill the racket boss for some quick cash or recruit them for improved earn in the long run. Which is what we're going to do. All right, let's get out of the car. Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. We're right here. Here we go. You know how I always He's going to shoot somebody as an ugly baby. Well, that little bastard next door is causing me to reconsider my way of thinking. I just know I'm going to hell for saying that. No, you don't. Take 
that sentry out. Recruiting a, a ra racket boss can increase the earn of any rackets you secure. Wiretap the rackets. We did wiretap his racket. Boy, let's see what you son of a bitch! Uh. Okay, buddy. You're you belong to me now. Recruit for me, and you might live long enough to raise your family. Okay, sure thing. Whatever you want. That's good, Charlie. Real good. Ooh, and then you break his arm. <laughs> Smack racket secured. Sweet. All right, thirty grand increase. Informant spared two. Bosses spared. 2,000, 64,000, Rackets in current district one. Nice. Marker, expenses for your next call to Cassandra's associates will be covered. Uh, gunsmith improved accuracy. Jean-Baptiste will tune your weapons and sights, increasing your accuracy. Okay. Uh, assigned to Cassandra. Weed. Sure. Send your men to the First Baptist Church. Those Dixie heathens have been handled. Nice. Okay. 60 grand. Improved accuracy. Nice. I like improved accuracy. Please state your name for the record. Donovan. John. Mr. Donovan. You understand that by appearing before this committee, you have explicitly waived your constitutional rights in regards to counsel and self-incrimination. Sure. And you further acknowledge that by appearing before this committee, you agree to disclose all information pertaining to the events that occurred in New Bordeaux during the summer and fall of 1968. <laughs> I wouldn't be sitting here if I didn't. You were an operative in the Central Intelligence Agency from 1953 to 1969, is that correct? That's right. When did you arrive in Vietnam? August of 1961. Please describe for this committee the actions you took during your time in Vietnam. I spent a couple months in Saigon, then I was transferred to a base in Laos that was operated by the Special Activities Division. We trained and equipped the Hmong and then turned them loose on the NVA. We're running arms and supplies via the Ho Chi Minh Trail. And you worked with Lincoln Clay in what eventually became the Phoenix Program. Within a year or so, Lincoln was heading up his own PRU. We'd cross over into Vietnam and locate enemy targets and either kill them or bring them back for interrogation. <laughs> Just thinking about it? Jesus Christ. You wouldn't believe the shit we did to those cocksuckers. <laughs> he just doesn't care, does he? <laughs> He's like, I don't care. Okay. Uh, kill Richie Doucette. Talk to Cassandra. Okay. That's cool. Um, we'll do that. Eventually. Uh, maybe not right this second. Yeah, okay. I need to unlock some weapon slots, is what I need to do. I 
I only got the two, which is annoying. Um, I guess we're, we're full up here. Okay. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look at the map. Uh, so, we have completely taken over all of uh, Delray Hollow, with the exception of this place. So that's where we're going to go. Let's go head over here. We're cleaning this place up right thanks to you. Hey, no problem, man. No problem. Why are you not giving me a path there, guys? I'm sure that I said, go here. All right, let's go. Let's go bug that, that once last section of town and then uh, we'll clear it out. And that will be Delray Hollow done. Clear it out. Done, I'm, I'm digging. I don't know how much is left over here. I mean, it's a big area, but it's not, um, it seems like it's gonna be kind of sparsely I don't know. Well, who knows? Actually, I, I shouldn't say that. I don't know if it's going to be sparsely uh, populated or not. We'll go find out. I have 20 um, little bug chips to use. I guess maybe that's the max I can carry. I'm not really sure. Hey, hey, I'm driving here. Okay, we're about here. All right, go check this out. And clink. I don't even know why they. That's it's such a piece of cake. Like, what? What is even the deal with that? Okay, that cost me three. Yeah, huh? Big Rick's custom auto. Um. Okay, yeah, there really isn't that much here. There's just one thing up here, which is an album cover. Fair enough. Let's go get it. Yeah, right. Unless you're black, that is. That there's one of them silver rights. Hang on a second. Uh oh no, there's two two things here. Okay, hang on. Sorry, sorry. Um, excuse me, lady. Don't mind me. Boom. Maybe that gets more difficult. Let's get further in the game. I'm just going to snag that right there. Don't mind me. I'm good. Now there was something over here. Maybe upstairs? What things over here? Here's another one. 19. All right. Very, very nice. Um, there's a thingy there, but I don't need it. Okay. We are good. Uh, we're going to leave the car. No idea. Oh, it's over here. Okay. I saw it. I saw it on the map. Just for a second. Big Rick's custom auto. Hmm. Okay, now we can go. Okay, let's go get this rock, uh, this uh, album cover, and then that's Delray Hollow done, I do believe. Here. Let's go check it out. Collection. 
album covers. 10% complete now. Uh, the Chambers Brothers, time, the time has come. All strung out over you, people get ready, so tired. Romeo and Juliet, in the midnight hour. But the world needs more is love. I can't stand it, Uptown. The time has come. Today, please don't leave me. Sweet. Very, very nice. All right. Cool. Okay, if I'm not mistaken, at this point, we have finished all of Delray Hall. This is this is Bayou Phantom. So yeah, Delray Hall is done. This up here is Barclay Mills. And this over here is some other Sinclair Parish. So yep. Very nice. Totally finished. All right, let's go talk to Cassandra. This district belongs to us now. Me and Cassandra. And I'm okay with that. do I have? Almost none. Damn. Well, you get some money in this game, but you also spend it real fast. Alright, let's go see what she's got to say. What can I do you for? This man's name is Jesse. We were just having ourselves a little conversation about which you do say. Listen. I ain't done nothing, you hear? I don't know anything. I, I was just taking a walk and walking down the street and, and she just grabbed me, is all. You with Dixie Mafia? No! Yes, I mean, shit! I did it for the money, you hear? I, I ain't got nothing personal against y'all. I don't even carry a gun. Where's Doucette? He's. He's out of the abandoned amusement park to the west of here. Banned Saturdays? What the hell is he doing out there? From what I heard, it's because you've been tearing things up. Georgie, Georgie's on a goddamn warpath. He wants Richie dead. So Richie, he grabbed what was left of the heroin and took off. Said he was gonna lay low until he could settle things with Georgie. How many men he got with him? Hell, I don't know. All of them. Hand me that knife. No, no, please. No, I ain't done nothing to y'all. No, please, I, I'm begging you. My mama, my papa. Go on, get. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Pick a one, do set. He ain't no threat to nobody. Let him run back home to his mama. If you wrong, there'll be hell to pay. Yeah. Killing Richie, you've taken over the smack and prostitution rackets, drawing Richie Doucet and the Dixie Mafia out of their hole. This is how you'll go after Marcano, by uncovering and seizing control of his criminal rackets, then confronting his lieutenants and capos. After taking down his rackets, you'll be able to go after Marcano himself. Go kill Richie Doucette and take control of the hollow. All right, let's go do it. Kill Richie Doucette. Pray on the way up. Story mission. Go to Baron Saturdays. All right. Um, hang on a second. Do we have... No, I guess we don't. Okay. Well, Richie Doucette. Let's go have a word. Oh, for the love of pizza. Watch it. Sorry. Excuse me. Pardon moi. Hmm. 
Let me just take a quick look here. Do we have the ability? No, I don't think we do have the ability to bug anything. We're going to have to do this blind. That's fine. We can do that. I have no money. Which is a problem. I'm not quite sure why the cart <laughs> took a premature rate. I did not tell it to do that. Have a word, Mr. Doucette. Why do they always have arcade place? Why is it getting deep in here? Huh? Um, how do we get in here? about this man. Richie needs to work his shit out with Georgie. Well, he ain't got no fucking chores. Cause if he don't, we fucked like your mama on shit his man. There is no rest for the wicked. Welcome to Baron Saturday's Fun Park. We're sure happy to have you with us today. So put your troubles aside and enjoy yourself. You never know what that dirty old baron's got waiting for you round the corner. See you over there. Who else wants some? Gotta change bags. Good night. All right, that's good enough. Yes, he is. Yes, he is picking you off. Good back, damn fool. Give you a 
not to Jesus, boy, because your ass is mine. You keep on thinking that, my friend. Shit, motherfucker. motherfucker cannot shake my resolve. Oh, that's got a sting. Uh-oh. More guys coming. Bitch, pick your face up out of there. I'm gonna swap weapons. Now, on your ride, we got the carnival carousel. A nice place for you boys and girls to stay out of trouble. But if you're one of those adventurous types, you might want to head over and meet the meanest gators. Dude, you are so dead. Okay, that's good. I can't, I think we can replace that gun at any time with the at the van for free. You gotta be kidding me. Dude, I've only shot you like 150 times. Now get the hell down. Prime me sakes.
Give me that gun. Who's left? Come on, man. Thanks for the ammo. Boy's gonna be running all his life. Doubtful. Doubtful fool. Anybody out here? Hey, motherfucker! We know you're around right here somewhere. Show yourself. Come on now, we'll Okay. Okay. Move up a bit. I'm empty. Tough spot to get out of. I wasn't kidding when he said it had all the guys. Oh, 
I guess I have no ammo. Come on. I must have killed like 90 guys. Medicine cabinet over here. If we can get to it. Pistol. I think there's a guy with a pistol back here somewhere. I'm running low on ammo and stuff. Dear fool. Throwing that crap at me, buddy. done Richie where you at my dude Okay. Jack, am I supposed to be able to find this guy? Was 
Charlie. Jesus. That actually did scare me. Bye. To switch between these quickly. Some say things got much worse. The hero they needed came in the form of a young priest. Hmm. I'm gonna figure out if there's a way to switch between those weapons real fast. Oh, oh there we go. Yep. It's the uh, left shoulder button. Okay. Jack. Hey, you're throwing that stuff at me, fool. Hey, don't you be coming up on me. Where you at, fool? Out ammo. Take him down. <laughs> Good. Bye, fool. Oh, you're in for a world of hurt now, my friend. You are in for a world of hurt now. You need, need to run this through, boy. 
You think you can come in here and steal my heroin without nobody noticing? I'm not here to steal your heroin, Richie. I'm here to make you pay for what you did to Sammy and Ellis Robinson. I didn't have nothing to do with it! I watched you stab Ellis in the gut. I couldn't do nothing about it then, but I sure as hell can now. Oh, God damn it. None of that was my idea, you hear? It was all Georgie, him and his old man. They wanted y'all gone, not me. Uh, what was I supposed to do, say no? Either that or make sure that I was dead. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> no, please, please. Listen, listen, just decent thing would be to let a man get in a prayer before you kill him. You can pray on the way up. Oh, man, that's rough. <laughs> oh, dear. When I saw Richie Doucette hanging from that Ferris wheel, I felt a profound sense of disbelief. Nothing like this had ever happened before. You mobsters killed each other all the time, but it was generally a small, contained event. Some greaseball is eating spaghetti and meatballs at his favorite restaurant and gets popped in the head. But this was different. Even then, even before I knew who killed him, I knew that Richie had been put on display. Lincoln was trained in psychological warfare by the CIA. He wanted to terrify the mob, wanted them to know he was going to kill every last one of them and that none of them would be able to stop him. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, you ain't gonna be able to stop me. Kill Richard Doucet complete. Or Doucet, I don't know how you say it. Uh, story mission unlocked. That goes both ways. All right, nice. That goes both ways. Talk to Cassandra. Cool. Well, I guess we are done here. Um, let's just take a quick look. I mean, sure. We're back in Delray Hollow, I guess. Or is this Delray Hollow? I don't really know. Yeah, it is. So the there's a junction box out here in the bio. 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 Um. All right. Very cool. Got some kickback money sitting up here. Uh. All right, guys. Let's go. Let's go through our stuff. Um. So y'all have seen the map. Uh. Let's just zoom out a little bit. There's the French ward and our father James Bollard's place. Um, yeah, okay, okay. I mean, you know, sure. I guess we were, where were we? We were down here, right? So I guess the bio is next. Um, sure, sure. Oh, there's a thing here. I missed a thing. <gasps> no, that's unacceptable. Unacceptable. Did it put it on the map? Oh, damn, dude, that's not cool. Um, we take the, the boat. Coming at you from deep inside the hollow. And tonight, we're going to talk about the things happening right here in New Bo Turn that off, please. Hang on, we got to go get that off before we, we sign off. I cannot have that on my map. I was told we had cleared out the Delray Hollow. Dude, what is wrong with this boat? We are not going the right direction. Come on now. Come on. You can do it. We're heading straight through here. Oh, this will do. Okay. I'm just going to borrow this car right here. Turn off the radio. Sorry, I can't have the radio going. All right, guys, sorry, we'll just get this one last little thing, and then we're out of here. Um, I don't want this sitting here on my map.
hiding behind this uh, this icon, I guess. On here. There we go. There we go. Um, let's see. Collection. Album covers. High and low down, light and slim. Alive, natural sound. Nice. Cool. All right, very cool. All right, guys. That's that. We are done in Delray Hollow. We should be. I don't see any other things on the map, so we should be good. Uh, hopefully there's nothing else hiding underneath the uh, icons and stuff, but I don't see anything. So I think we're all right. Um, let's go through our kill list. This dude is done. Defeated. Um, let's see. So that's done, but there's nothing new. Nothing new on the kill list. Assets. We got just Cassandra still. That's cool. Uh, journal. Let's see. Let's go back to the archives. Um, I found the mastress and pistol solid rate of fire doesn't jam reliable as hell. Let's see, uh, turns out old Charlie Kincaid's loyalties didn't run too deep after all. Now he works for me, selling weed out of the old church. He's been working on a technique to slow the erosion of the barrels of my guns. I didn't understand a word of what he was saying, but it means the accuracy of my weapons is a whole lot better. Oh, I met Cassandra's gunsmith, Clinton Jean Baptiste. That's all the part of the same thing. I didn't realize. Cassandra is now using the community church in the hollow to run weed. Turns out Richie Doucette's the only one. Turns out Richie Doucette's the one who stabbed Ellis to death. Him and the rest of the Dixie Mafia cocksuckers are fucking done when it comes to the hollow. Yeah. Okay. Very nice. All right, collection you guys have seen. We picked up um, some new albums today and some new propaganda. So very cool. And that's that. Uh, we are good here. So, all right. Okay, guys. Well, that's it. We are done here. So we will stop here and we will pick this back up in the next episode. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Thanks a lot. Hello.